Hello everyone, it's B, otherwise known as Sugar and Beets, and today I will be talking about art therapy. And before I start on that topic, I will just talk a little bit about this painting. Uh, it, she's supposed to be falling. I did turn the painting around at the end, but I like it this way, so she's falling feet first. Um, and I am happy with the outcome of this painting just because I really was trying not to get in a perfectionist mindset so I was more relaxed and I used a bigger paintbrush and I really like was calm and more chill with this painting if that makes sense and if you're new here hi if you're not new here hi too hi guys thanks for watching by the way and grab some tea or some water for this next few minutes if you're not feeling so good or if you just need to relax and I'll talk about today's topic. So I find that having a hobby or something that you can do on the side um, can really help you with your mind and I'm so glad I have art just because it really helps me stay grounded and calm. It's like the one time where my thoughts aren't going crazy and I can feel good and really my mind quiets down. It's really like meditation for me. So if you're able to get some art supplies, you should, it would really help you out. Or even if you can write, which I have a hard time writing, but I know it helps a lot of people out. Or singing, which that helps me too. So really finding an outlet, like even if you do it for 10 minutes a day, that can really help you stay calm. It's just another way of self-care. So that is what I have to say about that. And yeah, so I hope you guys, maybe if you don't, you're not an artist or something, you try something out. Um, so that could help you out. And I have been using a lot more oil paint, like not thinning out the paint, which is good. So I think that's what made this look a little different. And this was my second painting today, but the first one, I don't know if I'll post it just because I wasn't feeling it as much, but maybe I can make like a little compilation of like paintings that I don't really want to post, but I'll make like a short video of that. And I don't really know, I don't have that much to talk about, so I'm keeping this video really short. And yeah that just art really helps me out and I really want to do more like vent art which is like putting more expression in the art like if I'm feeling sad making a sad painting but I am having a hard time um, expressing it right now so I think eventually I'll be able to do that and yeah and then when I painted the clouds I did them really really thick so that will take like probably like two months to dry which is fine and I was thinking of adding gems but I got lazy so I didn't but this video is almost done and thank you so much guys for watching and following me along on my art journey and subscribing and all that stuff and commenting and I hope you guys have a great day remember to drink water and relax don't be too hard on yourself um yeah Thanks for watching. Bye. Oh, wait. Okay, I'm just gonna still talk because the video is still going. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, thanks again for watching. Here's me turning it over. Bye.